पेशेंट केम विद इनेबिलिटी टू एक्सटेंड हिज रेस्ट इंजरी टू विच ऑफ दी फॉलोइंग साइट इज मोस्ट प्रोबेबल कॉज फॉर हिज कंडीशन हियर एग्जामिनर हैज गिवेन अ फोटो ऑफ ह्यूमरस बोन एंड इट हैज some markings a b c d remember here when patient is not able to extend his wrist what does it mean this is a case of wrist drop this is a case of wrist drop okay so out of a b c d now you tell me from which part radial nerve might be passing okay from a spiral groove right from a spiral groove we know that here in the center you can see what a spiral groove spiral groove where two important structures are passing one is a radial nerve another is one blood vessel that is called the profunda brachii that is called the profunda brachii right so here answer will be b but related to similar question multiple questions can be framed let me show you few examples first question See in a case of shaft of humerus fracture orthopedician has to take extra precaution to preserve which anatomical structure answer is obviously radial nerve radial nerve second question from the same situation a patient came with inability to move his fourth and fifth fingers on examination he was not able to hold a piece of paper between his fingers okay injury of which of the following site is most probable cause for his condition in this case patient is not able to move his fourth and fifth finger he is not able to keep a paper in between the fingers basically examiner is talking about card test okay now you tell me see here so here like supply is of ulnar nerve right and out of abcd from where ulnar nerve is passing ulnar nerve is passing from medial epicondyle right so option c here see the point right medial epicondyle so answer will be c injury to medial epicondyle can cause the injury of ulnar nerve one more question damage of axillary nerve is expected when there will be fracture at which part of given bone axillary nerve at the surgical neck of humerus so answer will be a here next question during the surgery near a spiral groove of humerus surgeon got nervous and damaged other structures too in post operative days patient is complaining of inability to extend his wrist this is also a case of wrist drop what can be the probable cause obviously radial nerve injury basically what i have shown you out of similar topic in how many manners question can be framed i hope all these points are clear to all of you now let's learn some more clinical aspect related to point a b c d say here suppose if there will be inflammation at c or inflammation at d now you tell me what will be the condition see golfer's elbow whenever there will be medial epicondylitis medial epicondylitis it is called as golfer's elbow in the similar manner at point d see lateral epicondylitis lateral epicondylitis it will be causing tennis elbow and what about the students who are sitting like this right now so now there can be severe inflammation at the lower part and that is called as what olecranon bursitis olecranon bursitis what about nurse maid's elbow this is called as the pulled elbow in a child this is called as pulled elbow so with the one question we have learned so many points